That's a huge fish. <laughs> episode of it gets real it's your boy be the flossy fisherman and today man we back at ocean beach in san francisco california out here man trying to get my crab on you know as you can see everybody else is going i mean man it is so packed it is so lit out here but yeah man you know how this goes Y'all keep it locked and see if I can't hook up on something. So once again, man, rocking with the Reaper. Shout out to Ken Crab Slayer. Yeah, man. Got my 10 foot Pin Battle 2. 8,000 reel. And uh, since the swell out there is kind of, kind of rough. Threw some extra weight up in here, man. So now this is a total of 11 ounces. So it doesn't get tossed around, man. When I'm out there, I'm trying to get it to stay still and hold some ground. Now what would be ideal is if I have one of my uh, spider weights or one of the Sputnik weights. Because those claws with um, the spikes on it will help it sit on the sand, man. So this don't uh, move around too much and the crabs could get at it. Gonna stuff this thing to the brim, man, with uh, some squid. But other than that, man, it's a beautiful day out here, man, in San Francisco. Lock that on real tight. You got the slayer too? Yeah. yeah he just lost one of my slayers. Damn. <laughs> I lost one last time I was out here, man. Killed me. the hill this man just found a crab like that Ooh, this thing heavy definitely should have got me like a 12 ouncer but you know I got my guard my finger guard using this braid out here man this water softening your skin up enough for uh, this braided line to cut your finger man so Gotta be protected. Yeah, it's looking choppy. It is looking choppy out here. But that's why I got the waders, man, so I can walk on out here a little bit further to get a little bit further. I see somebody lying right here. So it's definitely uh the current is definitely pulling snares. on it so you gotta test your line to see reel it in slowly to see if there's more weight than when you tossed it out in the first place yeah and doesn't look like nada but a whole bunch of seaweed <laughs>
Uh, this is a six. So I threw an extra uh, five in there. All right, so no crabs on the first pool. Get out there, get out there. The homie NorCal Al just hooked up. Is he touching? Yup, yeah, barely that. Yup, yeah, look at that. I told you, barely. Barely made it. Wow, look at that, yo. Sheesh. Keep her on deck. I think you're on my line. Yeah. That's all my snare. So this is a male Dungeness crab. See if he's a keeper. Out here they had to be five, over five and three quarters. So we got the scale. Boom. Oh yeah. Yes sir, you see that. He's a keeper, it's touching. Yes sir. Incoming tide. Incoming tide right now. So current's not really taking my line off to the right as bad as it was before. Plus I also put an additional two pound or two ounces on there. So I have a total of uh, 13 ounces on my snare. And um, ever since I put that two ounces on there, it stayed out there in place quite well. And that's how we managed to get that keeper. But the homie's line got crossed over my line. He ended up bringing in my line and my snare had the crab on it. Pretty crazy. It's always something happening, man, on It Gets Real. You know, always something bizarre that's out of the ordinary, man. But uh, hey, that's why we call it It Gets Real because it does get real out here, man. Out here with the homie NorCal Al, you feel me? Tatty, tatty. Hey man, what, where can they find your channel, man? What's the channel? Channel is uh, the Bum Fisherman, man. The Drunk Bum Fisherman. Good. Yes, yep. sir. Got a couple videos up, mainly crabbing. That's my right there. So I'm cussing. Uh, yeah, man, <laughs> tap in, Bum Fisherman. NorCal Al on uh, Instagram too, right? NorCal Al on Instagram, yep. Yes, sir, man. The Norcal man produces, you know what I mean? Makes some slappers. Open everything, jack of all trades. Y'all yes, can time, man. Last pool of the day, man. It's getting dark and it's getting cold and windy. So we calling it, man. Last pool of the day. Hopefully I'm pulling up something. And we got nada. So, there you have it. Another episode of It Gets Real, you know. And didn't leave this thing empty-handed, man. Got about five crabs uh, between two people today, so, you know, can't complain, man. Something is always better than nothing. <laughs> you feel me? But yeah, man, to the next one. Y'all be cool. Y'all be blessed. Peace.